It is Pope John Paul II's canonization today. Let us recall the beatification of the first Filipino saint, JP II, as he is called by the youth in the Philippines, presided over during his papacy. This report from E.O. Galvez. The late Pope John Paul II was engraved on the scroll of Philippine history when he beatified Lorenzo Ruiz in February 29, 1981, held at the Rizal Park. This is the first time that a beatification was held outside the Vatican, a feat given to the Philippines as the only Catholic nation in Asia. As early as 4 a.m. during that day, Luneta was flocked with a million-strong crowd, all waiting for the elevation to blessedness of the first Filipino martyr. Upon the arrival of the Pope, Rizal Park was filled with jovial cries and frantic cheers of joy, made more meaningful when the Pope commenced with a prayer for the beatification rites. A con-celebrated Mass was first held, the altar especially made by architect Jose Zaragoza. After the Mass, Pope John Paul II spearheaded the reading of the petition for Lorenzo Ruiz, along with his 15 other martyr companions, including nine Japanese nationals, four Spanish, an Italian, and a Frenchman, who all chose to die rather than denounce their faith. The Pope was all praise to the Philippines for producing its first saint after 400 years of Christianity, and urged other countries to follow suit. After the beatification, the Pope spearheaded the unveiling of the monument of Lorenzo Ruiz in Binondo, Manila, where he spent most of his life. In his message, the Pope hopes that this would eliminate all conflicts between the state and the church. Truly, in his papal visit, Pope John Paul II shed light to the Philippines, bridging gaps and promoting unity and reconciliation to the different of society. This is Eo Galvez for News at One, Junior Edition.